Hello friends. Okay, today we are going to learn about how to add uh, items. Uh, how to add items from a, a list, from an array list or a list into a list box. Okay. So come. The first thing. Let's create a project. Yeah. And then call the project adding list to list box. Okay. Our project is right here. Okay. So um, the first thing I'll drag the a list box and uh, uh, a group box first of all I always like arranging my things using a group box mm, ok then I'll put it there add it to this box yeah so I'll also bring in a button. The add button. Okay. So uh, add button. Yeah. And then definitely I'll also bring a list box. List box. Put it over here. It's known as list box one. Now let's go to the method. Okay, the first thing that we'll do is that we'll create a list. Let's create a list of type string. The list will contain string, and then let's call it uh, planets. Okay is equal to new list yeah then uh, let's write a method that will add items okay so the first thing that we'll do is that we'll write that method private Avoid add items. Okay. So uh, we have there the plants. Let's just come and say to add items to a list. To a list, just come and say plants dot add. Okay. The first item is mercury. Yeah. Uh -huh. Let's put it Here is Venus at uh, Mars and lastly Jupiter. Okay, so remember that by right now we are adding at items. A list, not yet to a list box. Okay, this is just to a list. So by by the time that we reach here, our list will have all of these five items. Okay, and then uh, for us, okay, after adding these items, you see, let's now return that list. Now here, what this simply means is that we are returning a list. Okay. A list known as planets but this list when we return it it will be full with this planet list okay so we return a list okay then to the add button remember that our main aim is to update this list box okay so from uh, here this is where now we'll add uh, update list box okay we'll update list box 
with contents of the uh, of the list of the list known as planets so come and see list box one list box one dot items dot add ranges dot add range because we are not going to add one by one suppose we are adding one by one we would have used add but we want to add a whole list of items at once okay so come and say add items yeah this is the list add items but this list box that add items that add range which normally accepts only the arrays okay so what we do is we simply convert this list to an array using the to r to array method okay so let's run the thing and see here it is you can add and you can see okay you can see all the stuff it has added list to this box okay I hope you've learned something today. So please, if you like this video, you can subscribe, comment, okay? Uh, for today, see you tomorrow, okay? Have a nice day.